Okay. <clears throat> well, I did a review on the Coolster 125 about two years ago. Um, got a lot of videos on it, but I've had some comments. People were wondering how well it was running. So after two years, uh, I'm just going to do a quick review. Uh, let everybody know how how the uh, Coolster 125 is running. It's a youth ATV. I think it's a great ATV. Uh, I don't have to spend a lot of money just to let my son have fun on something, uh, you know, and then he can he can break things without me worrying about it. Uh, parts are cheap, you know. So, um, so here it is. We've been riding. We're we're up at about ten thousand feet, um, <clears throat> and it's been running good. We've done quite a bit of trail riding. I had to put some different shocks in the front because the stock shocks are pretty stiff, but I actually might have to get different shocks because these ones are still s stiff. Um, the only real problem I've ever had with this is that this left tire here got kind of loose. Um, I just had to tighten a bolt on there, and then we were good. We greased up the, the hubs and everything else, and, and it's, it's running fine. Um, <clears throat> like I said, again, we're at 10,000 feet. And this thing runs just, just good. He loves it. He can, uh, you know, go up any hill and he can keep up with me. I could do 35, 40 miles an hour, uh, on this, on the hammerhead here. And he can keep up with me. No problem. So, um, he's going to kind of ride around and do, uh, some quick riding here in a minute. And I'm going to follow him. So, um, we'll get that one on, on video here. Actually, why don't you just do a couple donuts and then take off and how about you take off, not being slow with it at all. Cause the last video I did, everybody says, well, why isn't he going fast? Well, let's see. Let's kind of show them what this thing could do. Okay. There you go. That's the, uh, you know, having that thing for two years, it's done really well. And uh, for being up at 10,000 feet here in Colorado in the Rockies, uh, we don't have any problems with it running. Uh, so if anybody is looking for a Coolster, uh, I wouldn't do the Tau Tau, even though they're, they're pretty much the same thing. I'd go for the Coolster if you ask me. Uh, that, I, that thing gets a good uh, thumbs up for me. Uh, so if you're looking at something for your kid, I feel like it could last him until he's 16 years old, uh, cause it's just got that much power. So that's, uh, that's a review for the 125 Coolster ATV.